everybody and welcome back to jazzy 61 so today's video is going to be one of my two week grocery hauls you guys i am speaking a little bit lower because it's kind of nap time in our house um but i'll try to turn volume up so you guys can hear if it's a little too quiet i want to say hello if you are new here and welcome to jazzy 61 i want to say thank you to our new subscribers and our returning subscribers hello guys welcome back i hope you enjoyed this video so let's go ahead and get into the grocery haul Starting down here on the floor, you guys, we have three cases of water. We tried to find some at Sam's Club. They did not have them. So I went ahead and picked up three of them from Walmart instead. Then up here on the counter, you guys, excuse those dishes. I'm going to clean those here in a moment. But up here on the counter, we have some bounty paper towels. As I mentioned before, we go through about eight of them every two weeks. So I picked up some more of those. Over here, we have some Panera mac and cheese. You guys know this is some of my favorite. I love some Panera mac and cheese, especially as it starts to get cooler outside. So I got two of those. I got some chili powder as well as some cumin. You guys, I'm going to be making some recipes and sharing them with you all over the next couple of weeks or so. So I wanted to make sure I had all the seasonings that I needed for that. Back there we have, let me get closer. We have um, some syrup for breakfast on the weekends as well as some barbecue sauce. I'll get into those cans as I rotate to the other side. We have some Philadelphia cream cheese, a two pack, as well as some Kraft singles. These are for like burgers and things like that. I got some Fiesta blend cheese. That's one of those recipes, you guys, I will be sharing with you. Then we make it some soup as well as some maybe some chili or something like that. Uh, I like to do crock pot meals, especially as it starts to get cooler outside. They're kind of warm and hearty. So like I said, I'll share those with you guys as they come up. We have some pumpkin cookies. These are for me and Munchkin. I think he's going to enjoy making those. So I wanted to get some of those for him. Over here to the fruit. I didn't get a whole lot of fruit this time. Um, just the things I can put into the fridge. So I got some sliced mango. Um, this is mainly for Hubby because he really likes sliced mango. So I got some of that. We got some more of those red seedless table grapes, you guys. Those are really, really good here. And so I went ahead and picked up another big bag of those. Back here, we have some golden sweet whole kernel corn. I did not realize these cans were like the mini ones, but luckily I picked up four of them, so it's fine. We got some black beans, some whole kernel corn. This is not the sweet kind. It's for one of those recipes, as well as some original Bush's baked beans. I, I jazzed those up, so I had to get some more because hubby wants some of those. And then I also got some more creamy peanut butter. We got egg noodles for one of the soups that I make, you guys. I wanted to make sure I had those on hand as well. And then on to the veggie part of the produce. I got some fresh thyme as well as a little bit of rosemary. I like to add that to one of my soups. Then I have some whole carrots as well as some celery. Then we have some shredded lettuce. This is for sandwiches, stuff like that, burgers, whatever we want to put it on, maybe a taco or something. I have a red or purple onion, one green bell pepper, three Roma tomatoes, and three white onions. For some reason, I knew they were going to be small, so I ordered three, and I'm glad I did because they did give me smaller ones this time. So I went ahead and picked up three white onions as well. Over to our bread section, you guys. I went ahead and got the pepperidge farm bread this time for sandwiches. Um, because we've been using the other one for PB&Js. So I got some Pepperidge Farm Hardy White Bread for sandwiches, some brioche hot dog buns, because I think we're gonna make chili cheese dogs at some point, and I really like the brioche buns. And then this was supposed to be the brown sugar cinnamon swirl bread for my husband. He's the one that's been eating the toast more than anything. They did not have the brown sugar cinnamon, so we just got the plain old cinnamon, which should be fine. We're just gonna add peanut butter to it anyways, but got the bread. Then we got the Texas toast. As I said, these are for like PB and J's at this point, um, where we make toast on the weekends for like my husband making an omelet or something. We'll use this for toast. Then I got some King's Hawaiian sweet rolls. I've been getting this from Walmart lately because when I get it from Sam's, it goes bad really, really fast. I'm not really sure why, but it does. So I went ahead and got a smaller pack from Sam's, especially since I'm really that well. My toddler needs it too, so me and him usually go through this by ourselves. Then back here we have some meats, not a whole lot because we still have quite a bit in our freezer right now. But I got two packs of the boneless, skinless chicken breasts. Those are both for the recipes I'm going to be making over the next couple of weeks. And then I also got some beef ballpark franks. As I said, I want to make chili cheese dogs and we usually get straight beef or we get turkey. 
So we got our hot dogs. This next section I call snackage. I don't know why, but it's kind of a snack section. <laughs> I got some Star Crunch. As you guys know, I like Star Crunch. And I ran out. And then the store said I didn't have any. And then my husband went in and I didn't have any. So finally got some more Star Crunch. We got some saltine crackers. So that is going to be one of those soups that I'm going to be making. Well, the other one I'm going to make a soup that I'm going to make some chili, like I said. And I eat crackers with both. So I got some saltine crackers. I got the original wavy lays as well as the classic lays. Um, my munchkin really likes potato chips. So we got that box. We're going to get a box from, um, I saw this box of these chips that we got from Tropical Smoothie Cafe. And so, um, we're going to get that for, from Sam's, but I like these too. So we got some of those and then popcorn is something that our little one has been asking for like crazy. He loves popcorn and in the colder months, I like popcorn with some hot chocolate. So we got some butter lovers popcorn for me and the little one. Hubby likes it too when we watch him football. So I guess it's good that I got some more. And then we got two boxes of chicken ramen noodles. My little one likes that as his snack after school. So I got two more boxes of those. Then we have all of our beverages and liquids for the next couple of weeks, except for those three cases of water. I'll start on this end. So I got some chicken broth. I already have some in the pantry, but I needed some more. So I got some chicken broth for one of those recipes. And then this, I like to make my own coffee um, or I can make my own coffee. I go to Starbucks every now and again, but I can make it myself. So I went ahead and picked up everything that I need for my iced coffee in the morning. So I got the medium roast unsweetened Starbucks coffee um, as well as their caramel macchiato creamer because I like the caramel macchiato. I don't know. It's a good pairing for me. And then I also got some ready whip to go on top. Yes, I do like whipped cream on my coffee. Then I got a half gallon of whole milk because like I said, it's just been me drinking the whole milk and I don't go through it as fast lately. So I got a half gallon and then to the ocean spray cranberry juices, you guys. So I got three of the white cran strawberries. I mentioned it's my favorite right now, but I wanted to try the white cran peach. So I got it too. So I have four in total. Someone mentioned the cran mango. You guys, I had that cran mango on lock all last summer. I drank it consistently for months. <laughs> so I'm trying all the different little flavors and so far or for right now the white cran strawberry is my favorite we're going to see how the white cran peach is and then this is for our new little our little infant baby over there um, this is his water that we make his uh, his formula with there go his bottles actually but we make his formula with so i picked up four jugs of that as he goes through the water kind of quickly i like to have some extra just like everything else so i got some more water and here is everything that is not our food. I got two more potato mashers because something happened to mine. Oh, it started to like rust or something. And I don't want to use it on our potatoes. So I got two more mashers, one metal, one plastic. Hopefully this one doesn't rust. Then I have Germex. So I said it's getting to be cold in the flu season. We have to have one in the car, one in the house. And we just used the last one in the car and open the big one in the house. So I want to restock on those. I like to have flushable wipes on hand. I keep some in my purse. I keep some in the car, keep some in the bathroom. So I got some of those. We got two things of the pure cornstarch baby powder with aloe vera. The Equate brand works really well for us. So I like to keep some of it. I got two things of the three packs of Carmex. I like to have my Carmex, you guys. Keep my lips not chapped. <laughs> so I got Carmex, some Cetaphil Daily Facial Cleanser. I'm hoping this works. I have oily and sensitive skin. So hopefully this works right now. I'm having all kinds of breakouts and I'm not sure what's going on. I think my hormones are starting to try to balance back out, but I need something for my face. So I got this. I got tiny little mitts for our baby. Um, his hands are big and these are actually bigger. So we got these the other day, like last week at some point, and they fit his hands much better. He can stretch his fingers and things like that. So I wanted to pick up a second pack of those pads because just had a baby. It done came back already. <laughs> some more Dawn antibacterial dish soap. I'm almost out of this one from the last two weeks. So I went ahead and re-upped on it. And then finally, we have our dog's food. You guys know he likes the fresh pet. So I picked up four more logs of his food as he runs through it pretty much every two weeks. Okay, you guys, that's everything we got from Walmart. I will show you what we get from Sam's Club and Target when we get back. Alrighty, you guys, so we are back from Sam's Club and Target. I'm going to go ahead and get into everything that we got from there, and uh, then I'll close this video up. Okay, so starting down here on this end of the island, you guys, we have our son's 
Pampers. So he has moved into a size two. Yes, my seven week old son is the size of a three month old. He's actually bigger than a three month old. We just went to the doctor and he is measuring everywhere bigger than a three month old. And he's like a month and a half. Anywho, so, so he has moved up to a size two in diapers, you guys, because those other ones started moving and they started popping off. So that's crazy. Then we have these Mrs. Vicky's variety pack of chips. So we went to Tropical Smoothie Cafe and we tried these, the sea salt ones, and our son loved them. We haven't tried any of the other ones, but we actually like the taste of those chips. So we went ahead and got a variety pack of those. We got Sprite. As you guys know, when it comes to cold and flu season, I like to have some Sprite on hand as well. It's good for settling stomachs. Plus, my husband just likes Sprite. So we got... We got a big case, a 35 can thing of Sprite. Back here we have our laundry detergent. So we have some Tide back there. And then we have our fabric softener, which is the Downy April Fresh Scent. I'd like to have some of those on the shelf, but um, the, this one we're just out of completely. So I'll probably have to get a backup one for that. And I just opened the last one of those. So we have some fabric softener and laundry detergent. Then up here we have these. So my husband and I were walking and we both saw them at the same time. So these are salted caramel cashews. I don't know if they have these at every Sam's Club, but the one here does. And I think they are really, really good. So we went ahead and picked up two packs of those. Then on to the Target things. <laughs> so first we have this apple banana oatmeal and cereal. So got a lot of those. Whole bunch of them because yeah. This is the formula that our baby drinks. It is the Pure Bliss Similac. Um, it's formulated after or modeled after breast milk. I'm all the way up there. I don't know why, but it's modeled after breast milk. So with Kai, we used the supplementation, which was also supposed to be formulated after breast milk. But for some reason, they didn't have that. We couldn't find it for whatever reason. And come to find out, they kind of rebranded and shifted it a little bit. And the only reason why I figured that out was because I went and found the ingredients for the supplementation formula and the ingredients for this one, and they were identical. There was a couple things that were different, but they were identical even in how they were laid out on the back of the packaging. So we picked up four of those to get four at a time. They still have a limit on how many you can get. And since he eats so much, because he eats like a three month old, even though he's not three months old yet, um, we like to have some um, stocked up on hand in case it starts to run out. Then we have the stuff that is not food. We have the Burt's Bees shampoo and wash. This is the original scent one. Uh, this is what we bathe both boys in. Um, it's really sensitive for their skin and it doesn't have a lot of harsh extra stuff in there. So this one is the original scent. And then this one is calming. It has lavender in it, but they're pretty much the same. So we got two of those because they go through them kind of quickly, especially since there's two of them. Then I picked up some more stuff for our room. We did get a rec we recently got a new mattress. We got a purple mattress uh, because ours kind of, I don't know, mattresses. I don't think mattresses are meant for people as big as my husband and I. Um, and so we tend to, I don't know, him being 6'9", me being 6'2". Uh, they get worn down much faster, it seems. And so we went ahead and got a purple mattress. So I picked up some more sheets and things like that. So I got this um, Rooms Essential um, jersey sheet set from Target. Um, there, It feels like a t-shirt. It's much softer than the regular sheets. So I got a set of this. This is the king size set. Um, and then I also got us a new comforter set because we've been using the same one for I think a couple years now. And I wanted something a little bit more fall festive and fresh we don't have anything fresh in our room <laughs> everything's the same except for our headboard so i went ahead and picked that up as well and for all of you who are wondering about uh, the target stuff target is the only place that seems to carry his formula we checked walmart we checked a lot of different places and they don't have that particular formula so that's why we go to target it's simply to it's a part of it and then also their soap we try to get it from walmart and it keeps saying it's sold out so target for the win Hey guys, so that is everything that we got for the next two weeks. I want to thank you all so much for watching this video and thank you to my returning and new subscribers. Hello guys, welcome back. I hope you really enjoyed this video and if you are new here and you are not a part of the Jazzy 61 family, I would really appreciate it if you like, comment, share, and subscribe before you left today. Thank you all so much again for watching this video and I will see you next time. Bye guys.